Dr. J, and welcome to the Guitarion's website. If you play a stringed instrument, guitar, bass, violin, mandolin, banjo, ukulele, any stringed instrument, I'd like to introduce you to guitar hands, and I'd like to share with you three important ways that guitar hands can help you with your music. First, guitar hands will cleanse your hands so that your guitar neck and your guitar strings stay smooth and playable. Second, guitar hands will moisturize your hands and will condition your calluses with clinical lipid therapy so that your fingers stay healthy and you prevent problems. Third, Guitar hands will decrease friction on the strings so that when you play, you can play easier, you can play longer, and you can play with less soreness. This is especially important for those of you who are first learning guitar. And it's also very important for those of you in the studio and for those of you who do long gigs. Guitar hands, uh, say for example it's 12 o'clock midnight and you're in the studio and you want to go to sleep, you've done 15 takes on a song and just haven't gotten it down and you've got to go another half an hour you think before you got, you, you're finished, guitar hands will help you go a little bit longer in the studio. I'm a clinical dermatologist and I specialize in dry and sensitive skin. I've worked with thousands of people with problem hands and I'm also a guitar player, so I'm very sensitive to the needs of guitar players, especially when it comes to taking care of their hands. You know, when you play guitar, it's all about your hands. You can have the most incredible guitar. Uh, this guitar, you know, Brazilian Rosewood, um, Adirondack Spruce Top. You can have the perfect strings. You can set everything up. But if your hands are not 100%, then your guitar playing is not going to be 100%. As guitar players, we spend so much time taking care of our guitars, but one thing we sometimes forget about is our hands. I'm going to show you how to use guitar hands. I use a thumb pick, so I'm going to take my thumb pick off and put it on the side here. What you do is you take a little bit, maybe about an inch and a half, uh, one tube of guitar hands, it's three ounces, it fits uh, in your gig bag or your guitar case. Also, uh, is you don't, they're not going to get you at the, at the airport with this because it's three ounces or less. You just put a little bit here. One little tube has 150 applications. Then you take it and you put it like this. It's a cleanser, so you're cleansing your hands. You cleanse in between your fingers and at the end you go to the backs of your hands. Make sure that you put it around your fingers by the nails and also make sure you rub it into your calluses so your calluses stay conditioned. This will prevent your calluses from from falling off from cracking. Now remember it is a cleanser so you need to wipe it off. So I'm gonna take two tissues here. I usually take two tissues. Actually I usually just do it on my jeans but don't tell people that. Uh, you just take it and you wipe it off. Now with guitar hands, it contains clinical lipids, so you need to let it sit for three minutes before you play your guitar. Um, I wouldn't just go put it on and go play your guitar right away. You have to do three minutes. One, two, three. Okay, after three minutes, you're ready. Um, now with guitar hands, it's like, I'll give you an example, it's like putting sugar in your tea. Some people like a little bit, some people like a lot. Um, you have to do it to taste. It, with guitar hands, it is a cleanser and you can wipe it off with, uh, with a towel like what we just now did or a Kleenex, a napkin. If you want to, if it's, sometimes people don't like, like having their hands go so quickly up and down the neck. 
I like it because I, it helps me to decrease the drag. But if, if, if you want to, you can actually wipe it off with water if, it's, if, it's, if you want to. Um, some people wipe it off with water. Some people uh, just wipe their hands with a clean towel. Um, you can just try several ways yourself, and then you can decide yourself. Look on our website. I have a question and answer uh, section on our website, and a lot of the questions are brought up there by people, and I do go through them and answer them. Healthy hand care is important to prevent problems and to keep your hands plain 100% their very, very best. As a musician, you have songs deep inside of your heart, and these songs are just sitting there waiting to come out, and you could feel it. It's like all the many colors coming together, color, 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 and color, and now it's a beautiful painting. With music, there's sounds, there's beats, there's notes, there's timing, and it's all wanting to come out and become a beautiful song. The way I look at it, I like to think of the goal as your instrument becoming part of your own physiology, the instrument becoming part of your soul, part of your mind, part of your intellect, part of your brain, part of your nervous system. So that, I'll give you an example. For example, you can think about something and you speak it. Okay, I wanna talk, uh, to my um, friend and I, this is what I'm gonna say and then okay, you put it together and you say it. With music, we wanna to get to the point to where what we feel is what we play. So music is feeling. It's feeling inside of you, deep in your soul. The music is deep in your soul and you feel it. But then when you play your instrument, you must feel it on your instrument. My hands must feel what the music wants to do. And if you don't have healthy hands, it's hard to really feel uh, what you wanna do if your hands are not healthy. Now, some people are blessed with healthy hands and they don't need very much help, but other people do need help. And not just for guitar players. Healthy hand care is important for anyone who plays a stringed instrument. For example, a violinist needs to be able to shift and finger the violin. A bass player, how many times have you seen bass players with hands that look like hamburger? Healthy hand care is important. As guitar players and stringed instrument players, we want to be able to go up and down the strings in the easiest way. <laughs> Well, this is Dr. J. I just want to say goodbye to you. Thanks for spending time learning a little bit about guitar hands. If you need any help with your skin, please just contact me. You can reach me through the Guitar Hands website. It's guitar-hands.com. Don't forget the dash. Um, I also have my office, my dermatology office website is my name. It's randyjacobsmd.com. I can help you with not only your hands, but if you have skin cancer, melanoma, complexion problems, if you want really beautiful skin, just give me a call. We're always here for you, and we just want to wish you the very best with your music. Take care, and God bless you. Bye-bye.